And greetings everyone. Welcome back. Hope you're doing well. We are in the painted world of Ariandel. Ariandel. Still. And I've done quite a few things in between episodes which I'll bring you up to speed on what they are. Hmm, yeah. need to get my bearings again. What? Uh, we've been there, I'm sure. Left required. Yeah, it's the bonfire. Um, got a new weapon. Well, not really. I got a, a side weapon, I guess. Or no, well, I upgraded it. So it's basically... Yeah, it's a lot lighter. Does not open from this side. Of course, a lot lighter. And the ultra great sword. Nope. Oh, that might be a bad one. Guys give lousy souls though. That's very nice, sir. Uh, armoire. Or is that not called an armoire? It might not be. I'll just call every every piece of furniture an armoire until I get it right. I think we've nope. Mm, guess not. I wanted to say, haven't we fought that um, that claw enemy down there? But I guess not. Yeah. So one thing I did was um, this weapon is upgraded to a plus ten because I got an uh, I got an extra tightness slab. A spare one so I still have one in case I really want to use something to uh, to upgrade the 10 but I got an extra one because I actually managed to do the, um, the Sigurd 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 of Katarina quest Catalina quest because I honestly thought that I had missed the opportunity to do that quest. But I actually went ahead and went to the... Um, guess we'll have to make that jump. <laughs> yeah, because we met him back in the cath cathedral. That's kind of the beginning of the game, really. So that was a long while ago. And then afterwards, he's actually in a... Uh, Stuck in a well. What you have to do is you have to get him his armor. You have to buy his armor from patches. But I thought that well, we've gone so far into the game by now. He's probably he he probably won't appear in the well anymore. Uh, but I actually went back to check, and he he was still there. Well, then I thought, well, let me buy his armor back from Patches, see what happens. Crap. I don't know if that was worth it. No, it wasn't. That's fine, we can go back. Um, yeah, and then maybe I should have... Oh, that's, that's bad. That part's bad, I remember it. Because that has another one of those uh, enemies. I want to go back to where I was. Yeah, I got I got Sigurd out of the well. Then where does he go afterwards? Hmm. He doesn't go to the. 
At some point he's stuck in a uh, in a prison, but that's not where he was just yet. He appears somewhere else before that. So I actually went there and wouldn't you know it, he showed up. And then I thought, well, let's go a little bit further then. And once again he showed up in the next spot. And all the way to his last spot. This is where we just were, right? Okay. So really the only place I have to go is to jump down there, get that item. Maybe... Yeah, but he, the end of the Sigurd of Catalina, Catarina questline, he gives you a tight night slam. Um, then he talks about he was actually heading for Yorm the giant. But uh, yeah, we, we had already beaten him. So he kind of disappears after that one. Although he does um, actually an extra... Um, Storm Ruler shows up in the Yorm. Chrome Quills. Is that a weapon? Yeah, it is. Special Thrusting Sword. I don't think I ever got this one. Wielded by Corvey Knights and a special paired weapon. When twin-handed brandish four thin-edged blades in the left hand, in their infatuation with Sister Freed, the Gorvian knight swore to protect the painting from fire, and to this end took the execution of their own brethren. Took to the execution of their own brethren. Okay. Hmm. See, the thing is, we have been here, so we might run into one of those claw gentlemen again. These guys are loud. Also upgraded my Estus flask to as far as we can get it right now. I missed one, one of the shards, I think. I actually had to go back to somewhere where I, where we've already been. The um, the Carthus catacomb. I think this is where I came from at some point. And another one I could pick up in the. Um, well, there wasn't really an area we've been yet, but it, it was very close to the bonfire, so it was really only just very close by to get it. And the last one, we actually need to head in a bit further to get it. Further into the uh, place where we haven't been yet. Wait, what? what? I suppose to go? Oh, I think I know. Let's go back. Ow. I remember you. Okay, now we're getting one of those very fast, very annoying enemies. We have a slightly faster weapon, so maybe I can handle handle him a bit better now. Don't know if I can do anything to prepare, really. These guys are bad news.
to you. Am I a bit of an, in a safe spot right now? I want to check something. So, uh, I had an extra weapon. That's why my bow is so far away. Um, so as you can see now, this weapon is, has 561 damage. Which, and actually some of that is lightning damage and magic damage, which is pretty cool. Hmm. But then, so compared to this one, 418, and this one's already level 8, so I don't think this will... I'd be very surprised if this would actually outdo the Heavy Drake, so heavy drake Blood Greatsword. And I don't think it'll go up more than 100 points of damage with two levels. But if we compare this one to... See, this is 561. Compared with the heavy greatsword at 580, that's not a, that's not too big of a difference actually. Um, I will say though, the the heavy greatsword, for some reason, I think it adds quite a bit of damage two-handed, way more than this 571, 576 now. So it only went up a few points actually. Yeah, this one goes to 619. So. Uh, the two-handed heavy greatsword does, well, almost 40 points more damage. Whereas this one only does, like, 15. But that's probably because this one does, doesn't do as much physical damage. And the magic damage and lightning damage don't actually go up. That's something I just only just realized now. By explaining it to you. Uh... Right, this was where the gentleman was at, who was talking to us. Oh, please. It must be you. I am so terribly frightened of timidly rotting away like those. Yeah. Kind of sympathize. Should I? Probably not, actually. Um, let's try to go here. Oh yeah, there will be another one of those gentlemen. There he is. Oh, he actually... Seems to be killing. Oh, they don't like him. Friendly, can I talk to you? No. Just throwing yourselves off the roof here. Okay, there's a door. You should see a doctor about that. Another arm wall. Any of you friendly? No. Although these guys don't seem to be that aggressive.
think I remember a boss being down there. I have pretty good regen right now because I think these um, both these so the shield and the ring pretty sure they stack okay so we looped back around and I don't know if I'm gonna step off to life so again yeah I don't know if it's worth it could this be a trap it feels like it haha <laughs> ah. and I got the tight night anyway he might be able to get up here though Sometimes they surprise you. Take a sip of coffee. Okay, I did not get wrecked while doing so. Hmm. sure what the uh, difficulty of this place is supposed to be it feels difficult enough to warrant going here later on but at the same time you you the material the upgrade materials you're getting aren't very good um, well yeah getting the lowest lowest chunk shards So there is a ladder ahead. We don't need to kick it down. Should I? Okay. Kind of don't like the fact that our cape is... Oh, there it goes. I think this is a shortcut. Oh, there you are. Welcome back. What? 
large titanite shard. Yeah, and again, they don't give that much souls either. Yeah, it might be because you you can you in theory you could go here pretty pretty early. So if they if they were handing out chunks titanite chunks here, then you could get into trouble making people overpowered. Are those trees alive? Yeah, I think we need to go inside, but stuff happens. Yep, they're alive. Get wrecked. What about you? Yep. Don't grab me. Yeah. No. Loving and grace. So the poison isn't as potent as our region. Funny. Hmm. One more. What's that coin? Young one branch. I actually discovered why we have a. Um, I had one of those young white branches in my inventory, and it, it wouldn't stack with the other ones. I was, I was really sure why, but that's actually because it was a branch that was gifted to us by. I think it was gifted to us by the giant uh, way at the start of the game and that one actually has a um, unique um, description that's why it, it doesn't stack hmm so yeah at the same time we we do actually unlocked that gate so we, we can get here pretty easily We may as well try to go inside. Will you, won't you come outside with me? You can fit through the door. Oh! out of stamina oh, 
There we go. Yeah, he's also a tough cookie. We can fight inside. Serve my stamina now. What do you have? We have white corona. What does that do? Slice into foes and returns to Conjurer. A last wave of white miracle launches a white discus which slices into foes and returns to his Conjurer. Long ago, when the imprints left by the gods were still deep, miracles of the way of white existed alongside Aureoles? Aureoles? Aure. Aureoli. Those who yearned for the long lost, no, that's that word again, fully believed that they would return one day. All right. Pour myself some coffee here, and we'll go inside to face a critical foe. Those um, those doors actually creaked in the same way, and it, maybe even the animation might have been exactly the same as as, as it was in Bloodborne. All right, where's the critical foe? I've seen your kind, time and time again. Oh, I think I remember Every this guy. Every man must be caught. Every secret must be unearthed. Such is the conceit of the self-proclaimed seeker of truth. But in the end, you lack the stomach for the agony that you'll bring upon yourself. Well, Wilhelm. Crap. Oof. That's a lot of health. Do that twice. Yeah, you're quicker than me. Oh. oh, boy's got reach. And of course you're going to heal yourself. This is annoying. Mm. Can I just cheese you? He knew what I was doing. Grabbing. No, 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 no. Yeah. Ah, uh, we might need our uh, a flask refilled.
Be better to go back or go forward. Yeah. Vilheim. I think we can get his armor now. I don't know if we can just buy it or something else, but I remember liking the look of it. Although the stats aren't very I don't think they are particularly good. Well. Oh. oh, I should have. Well, I think I still could. Let's read the key. Key to the contraption accessing the library attic. The key to the contraption leading to the attic of the archive found on the edge of the Carvian settlement. After Sir Wilhelm led a white-haired woman to the attic of the library, he kept this key as it were, as if it were his life. open thanks to thee. It is good. I'll head off to paint. I promised Uncle Gail I would. It is good. When this is the door is open thanks to thee. Hmm. Does not move. Oh, a bonfire, which we are not allowed to go to. Why not? You stupid bastard. I guess we could go there around. Um, so I'm wondering, this lady might be... Yeah, this is this might it's probably Lady Siegfried then. Isn't she? Yeah, um Huh, that's weird, because she's in the DLC area. But I think she might be relevant to the kind of the sort of absolute ending. There we go. Can we open? So that's weird. She was locked up in the attic, but this door just oh it's just open. Let's see if she disappears. Nope. Anything else to say? Tis good. I promised Uncle Gail I would. Uncle Gale. Scale. Oh, more of you guys. Gents. Uh, yeah, 
Yeah, we'll go here. Sure. How many souls I got? Maybe I should try and see if the handmaiden is actually selling Vilheim's armor. We might have to get it somewhere else, I don't know. But I'm curious. There we go. It's quite nice to have a weapon that doesn't weigh so much, so we can actually, uh, I, I did, I did realize now that if I, if I only wear the Ultra Greatsword, I could wear a, basically, standard Herald's armor. I think a sterile, standard Herald's armor in combination with only the Ultra Greatsword is doable, without having to actually go for the Havel ring. Which, I don't know. Um, yeah, our ring setup might be... It's okay-ish. But it's very um, defensive, I guess. Nothing offensive, really. Extra health. More health from Estus. Regenerating health. And increased health, stamina, and maximum equip load. So, yeah. But, alright. Ah, well met. How may I? I wish for thee to sell me armor, if thou hast any. Um. Huh. Doesn't look like it. That's a shame. Me. So yeah. Probably I'm supposed to get it somewhere else. Ah, I, I do remember owning his armor, so we are able to get it. I just don't uh, don't know how. Ashen one. Oh, <laughs> oh I remember where um, Sigurd goes at some point. He goes to um, um, city. Uh, this place. And the thing is, he can actually save Gyrat if you send him out. Uh, or Patches can save him, I think. Although I've I've never done either. I've had I've had Gyrat die on me in this in this area. So I could have sent him there while I was doing the Sigurd quest, but I. Uh, yeah, I didn't know how long that quest would last. I was kind of waiting for, well, probably the next step won't be, I won't be able to complete because we've already gone too far into the game to finish it. But nope, kept going. So yeah, at that point he was already move, moved on to somewhere else. So I couldn't send Guy Red away without him dying. Yeah, that's kind of the thing now. Guy Red is still alive, but if I send him out to get stuff, he'll die. Pretty sure he will. Um, let's go here. Did I... Was, was there any way to go up here? Anything to do? Doesn't look like it. Now I'm just bothering Lady Siegfried inside. down, I can go up, or I can only go down. Hello. You gentlemen seem to be waiting for me. Not actually an item. 
Really? So that path is kind of useless. I'm just gonna ju jux chug spears at you. Yeah, we. <laughs> I don't have as much range anymore now. Ah! to get through. And there's more of them. Probably. It was a trap. It's bait. Nah. Does he get those? And why was he hiding that limited, l limitless supply of? Javelins. I've got one. this no Oof. heard it coming Guys, how am I supposed to get? Hmm. I can't even get them. Yeah, now I see the item. How am I supposed to? There's another one over there, but it's it's up with him, so yeah. Up where he is. No no no. Yeah. Tree. Ah, 
gentlemen. Just because I don't like you. Will this break? Pleasure. Mm, no. How many? Five. This is a complete dead end. Just, uh, I don't know if I'm. S Should I even bother with them? Oh, well, if you're coming down here, at least we won't be, uh, we're going at it mano y mano somewhat. Actually, I was wondering if I could get any more heavy gems, or maybe if there was a way to, um, yeah. Oh, oh, I see. you drop anything good for me?
Stabs to the back, my only weakness. Dear Seeker, 15 faith. This large twin blade axe forged with bronze is a ceremonial weapon used in sacred rites. Millwood is a land of primitive earth worship where chieftain knights served as high priests. In um Multiple places actually in Elden Ring. You also get those types of enemies. Chieftains with axes like that. Like that. I'm kind of back where I started, aren't I? I guess I could go back. So if I were to... Oh, I cannot. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, so this leads to... Back to where I... Fell down? No? Oh. I think I'm supposed to push that, but I'm at the wrong end. Kind of annoying, because I didn't really expect him to start chugging. Ah. Yeah, spicy food. survive. It's annoying. Oh, yep. Why don't you come on up? I'm having a party up here. Tight night chunks around here. Um, I've not been here, I think. bother. Yeah, I, I, um, I also went back actually to, um, back into the first area, kind of the first bonfire, uh, as soon as you start out, yeah, in this area, to kind of see if I hadn't actually missed anything. Um, not really. Oh, 
because I had noticed that I missed a few missed a few items in that first area um, I actually went back to look for them but um, uh -huh. followers torch honestly they would just play dead <laughs> interesting Uh, I think there were just a few homeward bones, really. Kind of... Insulting, almost. Oh, no. Sweep attacks. Sweep attacks. Oh. Oh, I think we're close to that tree that I can pummel over. to a point where it feels very bothersome to uh, of course you have one of those Stone hammer. Oh, we got this from Wilhelm. Elfried, the eldest among her sisters and leader of the Sable Church, bestowed this sword on a knight. Only the sword was a farewell gift. And acceptance signified the knight resignation from Elfried's service. Which needs a lot. Needs a bit of everything. Uh, what about a quake hammer? 40 strength. We could use this one. It has a lot of base damage. But it's... Not... Not ridiculously heavy, actually. Well, not <laughs> compared to this. Well, it's close, but... 15 compared to 20. What does it look like? Okay. What about this one? What does that one look like? Yeah, I know. That's a pretty cool lock to it, though. How does it wield? Yep, great sword, alright. <laughs> That's funny. She cannot, uh, we cannot do the special. That a juice. Oh, boy. That's a tree. Come on. Up the butt. Ow. 
Ha. Two, like. Well, we have a shortcut at least. I think. Yeah. I think we're gonna head back just to see where we actually have to run to get to it. So, to the bell. Mm -hmm. Set light. And an item. Oh. Wait. No. Actually, maybe I shouldn't. Because I think this might be another shortcut. <laughs> Alright, so I use that one in combination with the other one. And then we can get to that felled tree pretty quickly, I think. Alright, but I'll head here for now. Call the episode. Next time we'll uh, venture on further into area though. I don't really even recall where that leads actually. Because we have that rope tree uh, that that rope bridge we can go across. Anyway. We'll uh, we'll have a look next time. For now, thank you for watching, hope to see you uh, next time, and um, farewell.